this one? Yeah, it's the same thing. Hey everybody, we're at Home Depot right now getting some items to fix our current home so that we can sell it and um, go ahead and purchase our new home or put bigger down payment on our new home. So now we have to get some clock for the baseboards after cutting them. So we're just headed to this little spot that someone told us about um, to get some like appliances or like little nooks and things to fix up the home. We're just checking it out. So we are literally um, standing outside because we were sitting or yeah, laying up on the couch waiting to go pick up our babies and um, somebody just ringed our doorbell. <laughs> so we're out here, mom and all. Oh, so uh, yeah. we're gonna go pick up our kitties and um, we're supposed to be having a date night today slash our anniversary dinner. <laughs> suck at this, but, um, this uh, romantic thing. We're yeah. terrible at it. We are bad. But, um, our anniversary was Monday. Yeah, we haven't done anything so yet. We still got to postpone it and move it to, to, to tomorrow, tomorrow because somebody wants to come look at the house. Yeah. Did you tell them about the people running up in our house? So um, <laughs> we were just in the house because uh, we have to get the kids around 5.30 and we have a viewing, I think at 6 o'clock, right? 6.40. 6:40. So we were timing everything. Like, hey, let's go get the kids, and then take a nap, you, take a nap, you, take a nap. you know, <laughs> and then go about our business. So we're like laying up watching TV, and all of a sudden, the doorbell rings, and I'm like, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> but um, it's a blessing, though. It's a blessing. We put our house on the market on um, Monday, and today is now Friday. We have two offers, and then a ton of interest. A ton of interest. So we're blessed. We actually have a really strong offer and we just wanted to let a few people just come see the home and then like to see if they had something better that they were gonna offer. So, I mean, I think tomorrow morning we'll decide. decide. So, we're probably selling our house in like how many days? Like five days? It's five crazy, days. right? In Corona. Yeah, in Corona. <laughs> in your professional opinion, do you think it appraise is gonna appraise that that price? We'll we'll you know what I'm saying, Wither? We'll take it. We we accept. Rose. You know what I'm not gonna... Yeah, we accept. Rose so. my ass. <laughs> <laughs> Rose, Rose ain't on this. <laughs> so I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> know. She know that. But yeah, we accept. I mean you want me to call Sue up here? She'd love this. She'd love to hear this from you. Yeah, call her. Mom! Come here, big news! <laughs> <laughs> Jump in, Harry. <laughs> Jump in. <laughs> Not in my back. <laughs> and, this, and this is the person that's seen the house, right? Is that... So, so I got back in touch with the lady. That... And we're done. It's a wrap. <laughs> Well, call gonna... the people tomorrow, other people, and tell them we're out. Sorry, you're gonna, babe. You're going to call them tonight. Hey, everybody. It's morning. So this is the day after. I have accepted the offer for our home. So we're just headed to my mom's house because I have some things over there from when I was in college and I had my apartment. Um, kind of left some things in her garage. And when we were remodeling this house, she actually put some things in her garage as well. So we're gonna go there and just clear up the garage as much as we can. And um, yeah, break the news to her. We're crashing at her house for about eight months until our home is built. Yeah. For real? So we've arrived at my mama's house. And we're about to do the reveal. We'll let her know that. We're about to stay over there. <laughs> <laughs> That's new to me. So we were going to pick up our the box truck so we can get the stuff out of the garage. It is. So then we realized one wasn't a good thing because my mom picked up a shift. Yeah, it's big. And so she can't take her stuff out that she doesn't want. And then two, where we're gonna drop off the garbage and stuff like that, they're closed tomorrow. So we would be stuck with the 
the junk basically in the truck which we have to return tomorrow so we're gonna pick up the truck tomorrow and then drop it off on monday so yeah so we're just gonna try to just divide everything in the garage and also that is huge we might as well just like pack up our stuff too you know what i mean because like when are you gonna get a chance like that i don't know we gotta figure this out that is huge so we basically just spent the rest of the day just dividing what we're throwing away and what we're keeping so that the next day when we get our truck, we can just scoop things up and be on our way. So you guys, don't forget to like and subscribe and just let me know if you enjoyed these videos down below.